lovely one. As you can see, just behind me there is a Lytham jetty, and over that side over there somewhere is a Lytham windmill. But what I've done out, I've come out tonight. I'm only local, about three miles away. Um, it's high tide just after sunset I think, there's no sunset on the cards tonight um, as you can see over towards Blackpool it's uh, I don't know how you do this I don't know if you can turn it down but uh, there's no colour at all so what I'm going to try and do is just do a couple of long exposures um, got the camera set up there um, I'll try and talk you through, I don't know if you can hear me or not it's absolutely, absolutely freezing I've got the black coat on tonight, this is uh, heavy duty so um, yeah I'll talk you through this so at the moment, on the back of the camera, what I'm doing is I'm going for a, a landscape put, um, shot. I'm at F13, ISO 64, and I'm just toying with either 15 seconds or 20 seconds to see what the difference is really. I've got a two second timer. As you can see on the side there, the water's fairly hitting this jetty, so I'm going to try and do shorter exposures because I don't, I don't actually think um, the shots will be too, too sharp really. Because it, one, it's really windy, and two. Feel on my feet underneath my feet the wind. The wind and the water is really hitting this jetty now. I don't know if you can hear me or not or what, so we'll see. So I'm going to try that shot again now. I've gone down to F11. I'm going down to 10 seconds because I think I just don't think the image is going to be sharp enough. Um, as you can see at the moment, or listen at the moment, the wind is absolutely howling. Um, we'll see. We'll have a go. I never give up. Four, three. That doesn't look too bad to be fair, but I'm just not too sure. We'll have to zoom in. See, if you look there on the camera, the, it's just not 100%, so I'll try again. So for this third attempt, I've gone down to, I've, I've moved the ISO up to 100. F11, eight seconds, cover the eyepiece. Two second timer, we'll just see how we get on with this shot. Not too optimistic tonight, to be fair, but we'll have a go. That looks okay, to be fair. Not too bad. I'll post the image of it in a second if it's any good. So for the last shot of the night, I'm going to go into, um, I'm in portrait orientation and as you can see behind me there, the water's fairly choppy so I've got it down to about 8 seconds and if the image is any good, I'll um, post it up. I'm not too sure if you can hear me or not so I won't be able to tell until I get back in the car if it's just a load of, uh, load of garbage or what. So uh, anyway, I'll take my shot and uh, I'll speak to you soon. So I've just spun the camera around. You've got these two clumps of grass that are getting covered now and in the distance you can just about see um, the windmill. So I thought I'd go for a little bit of a different different view than normal. It looks quite good. The water is just covering the, um, I think it's a marsh grass, but as the waves goes over it's looking quite cool to be fair. So uh, I'll give it a shot and if it's any good I'll bang it on.
so as you can see I'm back in the house now it's a little bit more warm and you can hear what I was saying so um, hope you've enjoyed this vlog hope you enjoyed the images and um, don't forget to like and subscribe and until the next time take care